Hello brethren, I bring greetings to you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I am Brother Hosanna David. I have a message from the Lord. Uh, it is a message that the Lord gave me a few weeks ago. It is not uh, one of those usual messages we get from uh, many of the top prophets. This one has to do with the end of the world and the time that we're actually living in. Uh, if you look at majority of the prophets in the world today, uh, majority of the messages has to do, they have to do with uh, prosperity, miracles, revealing tips, things, and not actually drawing attention, our attention to end time events and the return of our Lord Jesus Christ. We are actually living in the book of Revelation and also in the book of Daniel, the fulfillment of end, time, end times events are everywhere. And if you look at the current event, you will know that we are living in the very end of time. I have this revelation, which I believe is a warning to both me and to the body of Christ. And it is also the will of God that I make this thing known. Uh, in this revelation, I saw Mrs. Michelle Obama, uh, wife of the former president of the US. She was sitting with some persons and she made a statement. She said, a world that determines its birth. A world that determines its birth. That was just the whole revelation. And when it was out of sight, I was praying about the revelation. Why would uh, a woman make this kind of declaration that a world that determines is best? That means the world can choose when uh, it should be given birth to or choose uh, to be given birth to a world that determines is best. It's best. I don't know if you understand very clearly, but I said birth to deliver, to give birth to something, to a baby. And while I was praying, I had another revelation. Before I move further, I just want to make us understand something very clearly. This revelation, I believe, has nothing to do with uh, Mrs. Michelle Obama in real life. I believe it is just an illustration because a lot of times when God reveals things, He uses what we know to reveal what is known. And I believe the Lord used Mrs. Obama uh, to make this declaration in this revelation because uh, we actually believe, and it is what we know, that... Uh, Former President Barack Obama is a Satanist and he is an Antichrist. He may not be the main Antichrist that is going to take total rule and control of the world's financial system and uh, political and uh, religious system. He may not be that one, but we know he's an Antichrist. An Antichrist is anyone who opposes the reign and the will of Christ the original plan of God and of Christ in the world. That is an antichrist. So uh, as I was praying about this revelation, I had another vision. I saw a satanic sign, which is actually a hexagram. I saw a hexagram and then I heard the voice of the Spirit of the Lord told me and saying these things, which is actually the interpretation of the declaration made by Mrs. Michelle Obama in the first vision. The Lord said, the time has come when evil shall increase, a time of, rebel a time, a time of rebellion on earth. Now is the time when men dare to ask, who is God that we may fear him? Let him show himself and prove to us that he exists. The most wicked inward part of man shall be stirred. Evil shall reign as without any form of 
evil shall reign as without any form of restraints, for it is its time. The Spirit of the Lord also showed to me an inverted funny. Uh, I don't know if you understand what I mean by funnel. Funnel is, uh, is a device, uh, is uh, uh, an object you use in uh, directing liquid into, uh, like, um, directing liquid into something like into a tank you want to turn for from uh, a can into your vehicle uh, you use a funnel it has an open uh, opening black wide opening with a very narrow uh, inlet outlet or whatever you call it so that's a funnel it's used to pour liquid into um, cans I saw a funnel and the wide part of the funnel was facing up and uh, the wide part of the funnel was facing down and the narrow part was facing up so it's an inverted funnel I saw an inverted funnel and I heard the voice of the Lord said so it is and so shall it be Earth men shall be earthly, only a few shall be heavenly conscious. Uh, the, this revelation, I actually posted it on my website, so you can actually go there to read for yourself. It's on egoeyeopener.com, and I'm going to put a link to the this particular revelation uh, in the description box of this uh, video so that you can click and read for yourself what the Lord revealed to me. This is a time of rebellion. If you look at the world today, you will discover, you will see clearly that uh, humans are actually teaming up and rebelling against the will of God. And we as the children of God, we have to stand our ground and do exploit for God. This is the end time. The church, the modern church, is rebelling against God. The world, the government of this world, they are rebelling against God. Uh, almost all the sectors, if, on, if not all the sectors of our economies, they are rebelling against God. Um, almost it's up every sector of the society rebelling against God. Even uh, human sexuality, which is even worse, a uh, messing uh, financial system. We have a sy system that are rebelling against God. Nobody wants to actually obey God anymore. So it is now time for us who are children of God, the children of Issachar, who understand the time. It is now for us to stand and do exploit for our God. Let us know that the Bible says that perilous times shall come this is a perilous time this is the end of time that the bible talks about it is a time of noah where people will be eating and drinking giving in marriage and receiving in marriage without having any thought of god people denying uh, the true and only living god uh, it's a time of rebellion that people's consciences have become sad we have a lot of, there are lots of false prophets and teachers in the world who are leading people astray. We as children of God, we should not be a part of these people because this world shall be destroyed with fire. The heavens shall be shaken and there will be a new heaven and a new earth. It is only those who obey God in spirit and, and serve him in spirit and in truth that are going to be a part of this kingdom. I want to encourage you not to give up in your Christian life. Do not rebel against God. Uh, look for a true and Bible-believing church that preaches the truth and attend and stay away from sin because the rapture is near, the Lord is near. Let us stay away from every form of evil and not join the rebellious people in this, uh, in this our God. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Igo Ayopuna, and also Hosanna E. e. David. Visit my website, igwayopuna.com and biblicalsexualpurity.com. Thank you and God bless you till we meet again. Share this video. Bye-bye.